Okay, we just got done meeting a, a real cool young kid named Cooper, and we were going to go back out turkey hunting, but the fishing guide called, said get our butts over here, so we got one drift yep. boat here now. We're going to get the other one, I guess, and uh, fish on time. Yep. We were going to go uh, steelhead fishing tomorrow, but it uh, looks like a 100% chance of rain, and we'd rather uh, go when it's just kind of downcast like this and not the big downpour. So we're going to head out, and uh, hopefully we're going to slay some fish. About off the party, you trail it down. What's that, the anchor? It's all the spinner. Oh, when it gets down straight behind you like that, go ahead and bring it in. Oh, okay, you guys don't just drift it and let it bounce as you go. You can. Probably end up getting snagged doing that more often than not. Okay. Yeah, the only one back to camps, I think, is in there. Oh, he's a little guy. Little one. It's alright. Right? Yeah. Hey, this boat ain't getting skunked. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I see he's got that big old chain. Yeah. yeah. That's a hell of a note. You got to do the pictures all the time. You don't get to hunt and fish. <laughs> uh, actually, it, it used to be that everybody threw them back. They don't anymore. A lot of these people come up here and they keep them. Oh, whether they? they're clipped or not. And that's why there's no big trout left in here. Uh. Guide Brad, who's giving more entertainment out of watching Mickey get tangled up, snagged, rip the lips off of fish, <laughs> and everything in between. So we've already caught a couple little ones. So successful day already. So it's been uh, been pretty awesome. And I mean, this morning hammering turkeys and getting to meet up with Brad and have a good time. And so we'll see, maybe we'll get lucky and get some big ones. And if not, it's a beautiful day. Yeah, it's better to do. We got some steel and get on the Heck so, yeah. yeah. So big thanks to Brett. Which part of the day? Rich, you know, for coming out and taking us and man, just a just an awesome time here. Mickey's cooking something good. Turkeys, fish, and well not good looking at you. So we catch a lot of fish.
Yeah. Trust me, if it's a steelhead, you can feel the shoulders. No, ho, 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 ho. We need somebody back a little bit, guys. You're good. Try and take your fish up in there a little bit. See if you can get him above me. Well, what if we dip him down into them? <laughs> I see him. There you go, there you go. Whoa. Okay, here he comes. You get it? Yeah, baby! Woo! He wasn't hooked real good either. He got a runner. Huh? Oh yeah. I want to get a fix too. Oh heck yeah. Oh, we got to see how we do Oh, I ain't got much battery left. Oh. Oh, you're dying. Get him. Got him. You want me to get a picture of you with him? Yep. Here, give me the... The bigger one of the two. Michelle, you might have to take over this. Yeah, I will, because I'm going to get in the mood. kicking some butt in the North Sandy Am. That's where we're at. So awesome day. Let's get him back in the water. Yeah. Get him in there. Good show him. Good. Hey, grab that camera from her. There you go. There he goes. He's off. Right on. That was cool.
had a rough road, it looks like. Yeah, these winters are going to spawn mountain road. So we got to give a big thanks to Brad. Brad uh, hooked up the fishing part of this this weekend, and I'll tell you, you know, he felt a lot of pressure, but I, you couldn't tell because he got us on fish quick. So why don't you tell us kind of, you know, what what was going on, what we were fishing for, the, the type of fish, and and obviously the people saw we caught some steelhead, but you can kind of explain the difference and in, in what steelhead are here right now. Well, right now there's a lot of winters in the river, and then a few summers coming over, so still a little slow, but. We got some in the river, and we were fortunate to catch three today. There's a lot of trout, just hit and miss. Really, it's still early in the season, so glad we got something. Now it was awesome, but I'll tell you what. What the most impressive part to me was how you taught Mickey to catch a tree while we're <laughs> drifting down the river. That was awesome. The only part that I didn't understand, and maybe you can explain this to me. Aren't you supposed to hold on to your pole? <laughs> I guess when the tree catches it. Don't let go <laughs> next time, maybe, if that's any advice to anybody else out there watching the show. Uh, yeah, we were the second boat, and we happened to see some uh, tree going like this, and of course the pole was in the water. So I happened to grab a hold of the line, slide down, grab the pole, and pop it. <laughs> so. Saved him a little, a little money there. <laughs> Good thing we had a backup, though. Exactly. <laughs> but no, Brad, it, we really appreciate it. It was hey, an awesome appreciate day. you guys coming yes. out. Yes, sir. Thank you. And no as you problem. see, we caught a lot of fish. This is a oh, great yeah. day. Awesome. It so, was. So we appreciate it, and hopefully we'll uh, we'll come back again, and maybe yeah. when the fishing's even hotter. Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Well, that concludes the uh, the day of fishing with Brad and Mickey mm -hmm. on my boat. Yeah, Rich and Danny and I, we had a great time on our boat. Watched these guys drift past a steelhead and I threw in there and caught it right on their butt. So that was pretty cool. Yeah, it's a good, <laughs> great trip. We had an awesome day. Um, you know, Brad and, and Mickey got this all set up for us and just awesome. I mean, you don't get many days that, that are this good where yeah. you go out turkey hunting and by seven o'clock you've got two birds down and then you call uh, call Brad up and, and head on over here and catch a fishing. pile of fish. Yeah. So probably 25, 26 fish a piece, a uh, few steelhead, it, uh, really nice. Really beautiful area up here. We beat the rain, which is really nice too, because it's supposed to pour tomorrow and it's starting right now. <laughs> <laughs> well, we appreciate everybody uh, tuning in to this episode and uh, hopefully you, uh, you'll tune in for this next one uh, coming up next week. Fear the impact. Yet, so you can okay. do all that goofy stuff. <laughs> was that like the. What was that? That was walk? supposed to be Hitler. <laughs> oh, she just didn't get the goofy We were talking thing. about train wreck, remember? She, oh. She did that on oh. train wreck when she was on the. <laughs>